Hello and welcome. Let's model this simple ring with um, surface commands and curves. So I'll start my design with a sketch on the top plane with a circle 22 millimeters diameter. Continue with the polygon command with the 12 sided polygon. Pick any edge and apply a horizontal constraint to that. And dimension the offset here with um, 0.4. Then continue with the construction line from one edge, search that midpoint here. Continue over there. Um, shift L for the perpendicular constraint here. Likewise, that side. Um, intersect that line with that um, vertex and apply an equal constraint between those two. Defines everything. The sketch is it. An extrude of that region symmetric value for millimeters. That's it. Now make that sketch one visible again. And go to the bridging curve command. Start at that vertex. Go over here. We get that first curve. We can do that one more time. There. And take the fill command between those three edges. Then mirror that surface as a part over top plane um, continue with the fill right here adding to our one surface there it is and I'll with that surface, make a circular pattern 12 times, adding to the existing surface. I'll just take the inside of our ring. Okay, we got one part, one surface. Now let's take the enclose command. Take our surface and our part and keep the tools. Now we got all those parts and that surface. And let's combine everything with the Boolean operation union. This time we don't tools. And again, we got one part here. Now let's take one of those faces. This one. And um, offset curve. Pick um, four edges. 
um, with a distance of one. You might need to turn that around, flip that, the offset, and we get um, those curves here. Um, define a mate connector here, center. Move the origin with a point four. There it is. And now we can use these curves or these vertices and the mate connector to define our next bridging curve. So I'll just pick the mate connector. That one. Do that again. Okay. And um, now we can make a surface loft between those two curves here. Um, let's continue by mirroring that surface over the top plane. And let's define a plane by three points here. One, two, three. Okay, the mate connector selected. And let's um, mirror our two surfaces across our plane. Let's combine all those. And hide that plane here. Hide the mate connector. And I want this to be a stone set in the ring. So I will mirror that surface over that face of the solid. And again, enclose with these two surfaces, the stone, so to say. I'll change the color of that, so I appreciate that better. And sure. Let's make a pattern of that stone with that axis 12 times. There it is. Now, this is the ring, the first part. We need to subtract the stones. Um, here, um, from our ring. Okay, I think I want to keep the tools. Okay, that's it for the ring. I hope you'll like that, and I'll see you in the next video.